I want to thank all y'all for coming out today and uh, Wizards organization for picking me and believing in me as a catcher and as a basketball player. And the best thing I'm going to do is try to do what I did at the University of Kentucky is, is change the program and organization around and try to win games and bring excitement back to the building. So be ready for a good season. Uh, but, yeah, I can't wait to get on the court. You know, I haven't played in a real basketball game or practice in a long time. All I've been doing is working out, so I can't get, wait to get out there and show everybody what I can do. But like, they, like my coach said and my president said, it's going to be a learning experience, and I'm going to have my ups and downs, but I'm going to stay positive and believe in myself through the whole process. Uh, key thing is, you know, if you got both parents listening to both your parents, me, it was tough growing up. I was in a tough neighborhood, and uh, my dad passed when I was nine, so it was tough. And my mom had to sacrifice a lot. So if you got both of your parents, be thankful and thank God for that. But also do your schoolwork and have a good attitude. That's one thing I learned was to take school important and have a good attitude. And anything I can do for the kids, I like to. I like to get back to kids and to the community. Well, I've always said one thing. You know, you, point guards are not made. They're delivered from heaven. And I believe that he was delivered from heaven. And so, uh, you know, that's one thing. And I, and I think the other thing is, is that he's a very unique individual. Most, most point guards have... Some have size, some have the ability to create to the basket, some have the ability as far as to run a team, some have the ability to run a break, some have the ability to defend. Very few, I think, have the ability that he can do all those things. And I think the one thing that really goes overlooked uh, as far as with John is that I believe that he can be one of the top defensive guards in the league. He can be like a Gary Payton. He has that type of ability. And I think that you know, for us to get to the level that we want to get to win a championship, it starts at that position, and, and he's going to be able to do that for us. And you know, Everyone here has talked a lot about uh, expectations for him. Um, I've been very fortunate that I had Kevin Garnett as a, as a rookie when he was 18 years old, Stephon Marbury at, at 19, and both those guys are two of the first young players to come in the league. And as I told them, and I'll say the same thing to John, I give each of those players, you give you enough responsibility that you can keep on improving. And the more you keep on improving, the more responsibility that you'll get. And so. Uh, I think that he's got, I've had a lot of great point guards, but I think he's going to be the best. Uh, yeah, I feel like I'm up to it. He's going to take a lot of hard work, uh, dedication, and standing in the gym. And like Coach said, it's going to be a learning process. So as long as the fans understand, I'm going to have some downfall games and some, and some great games here because it's a learning experience for me. And still trusting me. I'm going to believe in myself, and I think I can. And what did you think when you pulled up here? You saw oh, great. It was a great experience, you know, to see the fans come out like this on a 90, like feel like it's 100 degrees outside to show some support and go crazy means a lot.